I wanted to set up goals for myself this year, so I decided to create small ones that were naturally fun and more than achievable if given the time and patience. One of the goals was to shoot 80% from the free throw line. Playing basketball has been my recreational sport of choice for most of my life. It has actually been years since I've played regularly. To be completely honest, I miss it. But unfortunately, the soreness of my ankles, knees, and my back do not. However, could I spare 10 minutes a day to shoot 50 free throws? Surely I could. Could I get back to being a consistent shooter above 80% at the free throw line? Probably. It's just a matter of practice and time, right? Let's find out. Day one, 26 out of 50. Day number two. As my sessions went on, it reminded me of how much fun it was being a kid, playing basketball after finishing my homework every day. And as the early evenings turned dark, my last shot would always be me trying to pretend I would make the game-winning shot. And of course, it would probably be at least the fifth shot before I actually made it. So second session, we got 35 out of 50 for a 70%. Not bad for session number two. Let's see how this keeps going. Session number three. It took a bit of getting used to, but getting up an extra 10 minutes early just to shoot my free throws started to feel nice. It was a little injection of exercise in the morning that made me feel better the rest of the day. So today was 33 out of 50 for 66%. Let's do better tomorrow. Day number four. So day four was 33 out of 50. Let's do better next time. Day five was not good. We got 27 out of 50, which is barely better than the first day, which was 26. We'll do better next time. Today is session number six. Uh, I'm wearing jeans today because I'm late. By day six, I had no idea how many sessions this would take, but I felt like I was getting more focus to achieve my goal. Session number six, I got 34 out of 50 for a 68%. If it wasn't for that first set of 10, could have done better, but let's do better tomorrow. So this is day number seven. Let's aim for 70%. So today, 34 out of 50, or 68%. Thought we'd have done better, but did one really bad set. So, let's try tomorrow. We have a, we have a special nighttime edition. Let's see if my vision is better at night. Or am I shooting better at night, maybe? I think it's day number eight or nine. It's early, I'm tired. Eventually, I started to feel more flow, more consistency, and I felt my muscle memory coming back. That was my first 10 out of 10. So on day number 9, we got 36 out of 50 for a 72% best we've gotten so far. But it was a perfect out of 10 that put me over the top. So today is session number 10. Let's go for 74%. Let's we'll see. It's gonna be interesting. 33 out of 40. So if I make seven more out of my last set, I'll reach my 80%. 
Wish me luck. Let's see. Going into day 10, things just felt right. Things just felt good. Every single shot felt like it was floating off my fingertips straight in. And that was all about to amount to this. Shot number 500. That's what it took. It took 500 shots, 10 sessions, a couple weeks, but I got to 86% shooting. Will I continue? Who knows? But I achieved my goal. So until next time, thanks for watching.